About a year after Hurricane Ida swept through Montgomery County and claimed the life of a teenager, leaders are getting proactive to prevent future catastrophes caused by flooding like this, and they need your help to identify the flood-prone areas across the county. News for us, Derek Ward shows us how new technology is being used to warn residents about a flood risk. We're still in hurricane season when the dangers of heavy rains and flooding are still with us, when otherwise hidden creeks and runs can swell and make their presence known in a flash of floodwaters. We in Montgomery County, as we have all around the region, all around the country, all around the world, are experiencing um, many more events of intense uh, storms that are causing flooding. A year ago, a teenager died trying to rescue an elderly relative when floodwaters from the remnants of Hurricane Ida rose to the ceiling of a ground floor apartment in Rockville. Now, Montgomery County's launched an effort to locate the biggest risks, the areas most prone to flooding. A key part of the effort, sensors, 34 of the silent sentries that will feed back real-time information on rising water. They're part of a system of sensors placed along waterways like Sligo Creek to give an early warning when the water starts to rise. The warnings provide an immediate level of safety and preparedness, where to send first responders, what roads to shut down. In the long term, the data from the sensors can convey scientific information, log trends and changes in flooding patterns, guiding everything from zoning decisions to infrastructure planning. The county also wants to hear from residents as they amass data. Feedback from folks on their experience in the county uh, based on where they live, where they work where they've seen flooding issues, when they've occurred, what type of storms have occurred, a little bit about themselves, you know, what sort of property do they own. They'll be handing out questionnaires and answering questions at public events starting this weekend. Other forms of outreach are planned. Edwards says they particularly need to hear from underserved communities in the county. This is an important, uh, an important effort. Uh, climate change is a big issue and flooding is going to be one of the biggest impacts of it. In Montgomery County, Derek Ward, News 4. County officials will be at the Gaithersburg Community Flea Market on Pin Oak Drive this Saturday morning starting at 8 o'clock. They'll be there to answer any questions and hand out surveys for the flood management plan. You can also take the survey on the Montgomery County website.